Pope Francis reminds medical professionals to emphasize both physical and spiritual healing. In occasion of the 30th Giornata Mondiale del Malato. In a video message for the 30th annual World Day of the Sick, the Holy Father called for effective medical care for everyone. The address was part of an online seminar organized by the Dicastery for Promoting Integral Human Development. Joining us now from Rome is Monsignor Charles Namugera from the Dicastery for Promoting Integral Human Development. Monsignor, thank you so much for your time today. Uh, can you tell us more about this event, how many people are participating, and also what you hope comes from it? Well, uh, today we celebrated the World Day of the Sick, and this is the 30th uh, anniversary of the World Day of the Sick, which is celebrated each year on the liturgical memorial of Our Lady of Lourdes. And the Church, taking from the example and command of Christ, it has always felt that taking care of the sick is an integral or an essential part of our mission. And so the World Day of the Sick comes to remind people, the people of God, the health, Church healthcare institutions, and the civil society at large to the need to offer the best possible care for our sick brothers and sisters. The Christians are reminded that they are disciples of Christ, and so they are called to walk into the footsteps of Christ. And the civil society is being reminded that health care or access to health services is an essential human, fundamental human right, which needs to be safeguarded and promoted. So the Church chose Our Lady of Lourdes Memorial because Our Lady of Lourdes Sanctuary is one of those uh, most dear sanctuaries to the Christians. It is both a place and symbol of hope and grace. And then Our Lady, who stood by the cross of Christ is an invitation to Christians to stand by the crosses of those who are crucified today. And standing by the cross of our, those who are crucified today means being ready to reach out to the sick people, provide care and consolation to them. And also, Monsignor, I wanted to ask you, um, can you tell us a little bit more about what the Holy Father said in his video message. Yes, the Holy Father in his video message thanked the healthcare workers for the work they are doing beside the sick people. And he reminded them that mm -hmm. their mission, through them, the mercy of God reaches out to other people. And since the message for this year was that be merciful as your heavenly Father is merciful. Walk by those who are suffering in the path of charity. What the healthcare workers are doing, what the volunteer people are doing in their mission every day is to make the mercy of God, the mercy of Christ, reach out to those who are most in need through their daily activity. And so their work supersedes or outgoes the profession they are doing, and it becomes a mission. It is a calling that they are living out to show God's mercy to the people of God, those who are most in need. And in their daily work, he called them or reminded them or each one of us that we have to put the sick person at the center of the work we are doing. Well, Monsignor, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us about all of this. We really appreciate it. Monsignor Charles Namogera from the Dicastery for Promoting Integral Human Development at the Vatican. Thank you again, and God bless you. You're welcome.